small battlefield. A Lucifer's in the chat. All right, let's go. Everybody root for James, root for MU. Let's go, Manchester. Oh, and there was a communication error. Oh. So now they got to remake the lobby. Looks like we're delayed by another two minutes. More time for me to eat. Haha. <laughs> Uh, might be more than two minutes if uh, James wants to make the same name again. I can't remember what he had it on, but he had a special name for uh, for Stony Brook. So I guess we'll see we'll see what he does for that. But um, as as far as I know, their Peach is their alt player. So unless they sub him in because it's a matchup. We can almost expect Pichu, Sonic, Mega Man, and probably Pokemon they have Sonic? every time. They have a Sonic. Oh, I don't remember Sonic. Uh, I believe it's on the board. Man, I must have forgot that guy. Because that's like a. Because what I was thinking when I heard this. Wait. Peach, PT. Pokemon. Wait, Pokemon Trainer. Peach. Who's the other P? There's another P. There's three P's. Pichu. Pichu. That's a lot of characters. Mega Man. And yeah. then I guess the last one's Sonic? Yeah. What you eat in pars? Stir fry? I mean some yeah, let's see if we can yeah. what since when did they offer stir fry in there? That looks actually really good. It's Come on, go use a Chicken rice, peppers, onions, carrots, All right. and teriyaki sauce. Um, uh, chives and two and chives, of course. You know, I have some chives in there. Get a little bit of vegetables. All right, his headphones are on. What you eat in the loose? Fleetwood bro? is locked in. All, All right, right. seeing definitely a bit more of an aggressive approach. Mm -hmm. So I guess one thing that we didn't really know, or didn't really think about, is like how good Mega Man is in the air with these aerials, and we can see already that he's just mashing them. We already have like we already have what he's gotten hit by two pairs and two back airs already. So Mega Man does have really good buttons. Yeah, so he's just gonna James is gonna adjust to that. See what he can do about that. James has already adapted to that. There's not letting this blade. Mega Man in. We haven't seen a side B yet. Don't know if he's saving on for it or saving it for more of like a mix up or Ooh That was a really good reflecting up Reflecting the down air. That was a really good up smash. That was, that was crazy. not on purpose. James, you could tell by the way that James just made his face. He did not mean to do that, but he is happy with that result, and so are we. That was awesome. James wanted to hit the Mega Man, and that's what he did. But he's already om he's gained just so much off of this Mega Man second stock there. He's almost set the Mega Man back. I, I don't even know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> it's just it's so fast. I'm trying to focus on the game, but I can't do that while talking. Everybody root for James in the chat. Let's go. All right, we already have 100%. They're both at 96% right now. Dead even, but we have a whole stock in the lead, which is really nice for us. If we can get the second one right now and more X credit on the third stock, be oh, big. this will be massive. So It'd be crazy if we even kept this third stock and we went in with a three stock lead. That'd be insane. Hitting with a almost fully charged mm, forward There's smash. a side B. And you put it for free. There it is. Yep. Almost gets a stock off of it too. That is crazy. And he gets another stock. James going insane right now. James playing out of his mind. Let's see. <laughs> yeah. I we're not really seeing much saw blade mechanics coming from this Mega Man. You know what? James is not giving them a room to. He, he, the arms are in his face. Any projectile is being stuffed out, so he is just crazy. He's being forced to slow down his game and approach naturally. We just saw, I think, one of the first up airs come out from this Mega Man. Up air is such a such so good. Oh, and the first Leaf Shield. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure how good Leaf Shield is in this matchup, but probably not near as good. Unless, Theoretically useless. Unless Min Min's approaching you, which we're not typically going to be seeing, especially from James. He's trying to get that combo. He's feeling himself right now. James is feeling himself right now. James is warm. Everybody rooting for James. Down it. Min Min down there. It makes me so mad. Ooh. 
Ooh. Not letting James recover. But he's Keeping back. Him at bay. He's back. He is back. He's got some rage to him. We're going to be hitting hard here. He's at 80%. We have a really big chance to get this stock right now. Hold up the Ram Ram. The Ram Ram. The big uh, yellow ball that James is throwing around. Just this thing hits like a truck, right? So this is massive for us. Ooh, off stage. So this is this is where Mega Man wants, I mean not Mega Man, but Min Min wants you to be. This is where James wants you to be. This Mega this. Man, Min Min. We got some four M's on the board here. Manchester, Ooh. five M's. With Punish. He's got, passes it back. We might see an up smash here. Oh, <laughs> you called it, James laughed. I think wow. James heard that from the other room. Wow. You a fortune teller. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Yeah. That was crazy. We're up two stocks against this crack team. That was like, awesome. This is that, is, that is amazing. What a beautiful lead. So clearly not their, I, I, you can't even say that that guy's not a strong player because our player played so strong there, played so well. Yeah. Like we don't even know what that matchup would look like if that was the best Mega Man in the world because That's... James just, that's not going to look the same if it's against August. That's not going to look the same if you put him against Clay or put him against Landon. James played out of his mind that game. Mm -hmm. And I'm curious to see what's going to look like these next characters. Because all these characters are really good at closing in the space. Pichu, Sonic, Squirtle. So if they really have the Sonic, they're definitely going to send him in here. Because, Sonic good in the Min-Min? Yep, because they're, if they have a two, we're, they're down by two, right? This is a massive opportunity for us to take a bigger lead, and they can't allow that to happen. So, uh, Min-Min's counter here is definitely Sonic. If they have that Sonic, like you were saying, they're going to send him in. Um, but the other characters, I would think, they will not send in the feature no matter what, because um, that just will not happen. Uh, who else do they have? The PT. PT is a possibility. Uh, Squirtle's kind of hard to hit, very small. Uh, and then very fast in the air and like low to the ground. He can crawl under arms and stuff. There's a lot of things he can do. And there's sub peach. So yeah, there's they sub peach. No, they have a they have oh, a they have a, a sub peach. Okay, yeah, yeah. So PT Peach Pichu. There's a chance for the Pichu, but Pichu is really light. Usually, you want to play Pichus when you have a lead because it's like easier to just take three stocks as Pichu. But it's really hard to take like five, six stocks as Pichu because. One, you're so light. Two, in a crew battle, you're trying to camp the whole time, right? Yeah. And you just do damage to yourself as Pichu because Pichu's so strong that she damages herself, which is, I mean, you know. You know, Pichu, I feel like one of those characters who struggles more in a crew battle setting. Yeah, for sure. And it's, you know, if they're so, if they're, if, if the Pichu is so good that they can play Pichu in this competitive setting. I, I'm curious to see what that'll look like, especially since they're champions for Nace. So okay, so they are in the arena, my guess. If PS2? Sonic's, if Sonic's real, they're going Sonic. If the Sonic's not real, it's B2. Sonic. All right. All right. Min Min versus Sonic. It's gonna be a, Here we go. It's going to be a real matchup. This is going to be hard for James. This is going to be really hard. But if you can take one... Even just one here with the two socks would be beautiful. The Sonic comes in, as foretold. Three, two, one, go! You know, everybody's, everybody's smiling in the back, too. Alright. Alright, and here they go. Straight into it. James opting to start with Ram Ram. Now, I've heard about this before. He likes to use that, the big yellow ball in this matchup, because um, I think it has priority over a lot of things, but it might just be because it's lingering for a very long time and it can stuff out a lot of like the spin dash approaches and stuff like that. So maybe that's why it's out. But we already did the damage. We're looking pretty good so far. You know, the lingering, the lingering hitbox would be really nice too, since spin dash just has invincibility throughout a lot of, a lot of the dash. I'm not really sure what, what Sonic frame data looks like, but that move is actually crazy. Alright. James actually ahead on the stock. Why do I need to... I shouldn't have thought. Ooh, unlucky air dodge. He had no jump. There was no choice for him there. That was a stalemate. That's okay. 
We've done 90 damage. We have the heavy hitting opportunity here. We can take this stock. This one stock with the two that we, we were talking about. This is so huge for us. Sonic is a very good crew battle character because he can camp for as long as he wants. And no matter what, like, as long as he's playing correctly, it's really hard for anybody to do anything. I think that's... That was almost a kill. It, I think it would have been more close to a kill if he did up throw right there. But it doesn't matter because now we have empowered arms regardless. So as long as we get one hit here, we are fine. We will be fine. And do we have any anybody who's good into Sonic who's not... There's the hit. Four. There's the hit. We got it. We got the sock. And we still have an opportunity for a second one. This is fairly... That being said, it's going to be very difficult to get another one. Because it's Sonic we're talking about. And... No. But this is our very own Fleetwood. This is our Fleetwood, so anything is possible. Do we know the name of this Sonic? Uh, no. I mean, they definitely do. Alright. Um, I, like I said, I forgot the Sonic was even on the board. So, until you mentioned it. The Sonic is not near as campy because of, of how fast he is. I, it's just super hard. I'm not sure if I'm not sure if Sonic's good in the Min-Min mainly because of how fast he is able to uh, approach. Yep, that's literally what it is. It's, it's the speed at which he can get into Min-Min. So this, this that's is why you see matchups like Greninja and Sheik being so bad for uh, for Min Min. So this is, so this, uh oh. That'll be a stock. That's, that's okay. Stock. We have a stock lead here. Um, we'll be sending in, most likely, the Sword Fighter. And we're yeah. gonna see how that goes. You know what? I mean, there's a lot of, there's a big opportunity for August to go in here, but I don't think he's gonna be comfortable with going in here. The, the thing is, our Augment, he did not want to go in against uh, the Mega Man. And that was the one person he didn't want to go in against. So, there's a big chance that we just get the augment right here. And he is comfortable into this matchup. He's not afraid of it. We also have Landon, who farms a Sonic previously, last year. So We do have that. We, the never, thing is, we don't know. The thing is, Landon, they're probably going to be wanting to save him for... Um, Anchor? Or not for Anchor, but more for their best player, Quid. Mm. Uh, just because, you know, or at least save one of our two best players for him. Just because, you know, we want to have the best opportunity at taking those three stocks from that guy. Because that guy has three stocks for us to take, and it's going to be pretty difficult. Is it locked? I think he's playing with us. Are you playing Do with I need me? to work the balance tree? Huh? Do I need to work the balance tree? Sorry for shaking the world, guys. There's a smash stream. Yeah, there's not. There's stream and balance after it. Are they? And what time does the Valorant game start? Yeah, this isn't going to be over for probably a long time, especially if we go to game three. Is it always oh, this nice? Yeah. yeah. This is uh, the best, best... Yeah, the Super Conference? Yep. Mm -hmm. Are oh. <laughs> Alright, looks like we are going to be sending in Scrubbed so, Out. there is the Landon. We choose to save the the Duck, the, the other best player, for Quid. But... Yeah, I mean, regardless, you still have the territory for quid if we want to. If we want like that cheese factor. We have a cheese factor no matter where you look. So who which one of our guys does best in the Pokemon trainer based off of their characters? Would you say it's August? Or um, would you definitely say it's... August. Matchup wise. He uh well, okay. It, it can go both ways. They have a frame one escape option, right? They cook they cook a button. Right. Frame one, they can escape. So August combos are gonna be harder to hit, so is everybody else's combos. So at that at that point, it kind of comes down to Diddy Kong just getting guaranteed damage because he can throw a banana, and then get true combos from that. And that that'll stop a lot of that'll scuff out a lot of approaches yep. from Quid as well. Yeah. So we are now sending in Landon into Sonic. I'm curious to see how this goes to see if this is a lot of camping. Landon holds up. He's going to be throwing out a lot of shur shurikens. Sh oh, yeah. Shurikens. See, <laughs> this is this is a game of who can camp harder mm. and hit the other person more. Now, he took him to Battlefield. I don't know exactly why. Oh, but... he's got that side B. Mm -hmm. So he's got the guild stab. Yeah, yeah. 
Probably no, probably no chopping Ooh. here because it's a little bit slow. So we're going like fast options. We got that side B and we got that neutral B. Because the only way to, we're going to be able to be fast is to be fast, you know? This is... He's out camping a Sonic right now, so it's kind of As crazy. of right now, yeah. But the second Sonic gets in, he's going to get a lot of damage. So. Yes, he will. So we need to keep this this going right here. This is this is a good spot. And we got the air dodge in. He's, he's actually nervous. Ooh. We have the Sonic nervous. I don't think he knows this matchup that well. It looks or like he, potentially. He's, he it does look like he's struggling at the moment. Um, at least to figure out Landon's game plan. It is really hard to to know how to approach a character you've never played before. Oh, he did di out though. Not sure if that was just panic because he was already already um, had his analog in that direction, or if he actually knows how to di. He what did it. A beautiful Ooh. spot. And wow. That was really good. That was really, that really was crazy. Good because Landon has already recognized that this guy doesn't know that much about me, Sword Fighter, right? So there's a big opportunity here to do a lot of stuff that he's not going to expect. 100%. And that's, that's worked on so many players in the past, too. Just because they're like, oh, he's why is he charging a smash attack? Because they don't know that that move can charge. Ooh, rough spot for Landon. And he does the uppie again. That's the second time we've done that. Uh, that super fast recovery using that upbeat so this this third time we're probably going to switch it up and but now we're making that sonic scared when we're on ledge right we already have a conditioning factor going the sonic when we're on ledge he's probably going to give us a little bit more space now so that we can get off for free this the sonic is also now just kind of trying to guess too so definitely seeing a lot of panic options landon is landon is just setting that chewy's gum Ooh, never mind <laughs> i thought that was a stock that's crazy. He got him. <laughs> Manchester up three. Didn't lose three. a stock. That's crazy. Manchester up three right now. This is beautiful. We have our one of our best players with three stocks still alive. And Going. they have two players. Two players gone. Pichu, Pokemon trainer. Who do you think they're going to send in? He just took two stocks away from a Sonic player? Their players definitely recognize that they need to get rid of this guy here because of the cheese factor oh, and yeah. being like a pro player he probably has experience in the matchup one way or another he's played you know he's played the game for five years now as most of us have but in those five years he's definitely had time to play against someone that has played this character so we're probably going to see their best player the pro player the pt um but maybe maybe we don't even see him just because maybe we don't even see him until the anchor maybe they they want to whittle us down with the pichu a little bit more but I think the Pichu's gonna have a hard time because, you know, so light. We get a down throw at 60 with me, Sword Fighter, and a That's down dead. throw and an up air, you're dead. As long, as long as they don't know the DI. Yeah. yeah. And Pichu, I think, would probably be a better choice since, well, Squirtle, Pichu, they're both small characters. I think all either of them has to do is really just duck to avoid getting hit by the Shuriken. Or the Shuriken. So I don't think there's... I don't think there's really just a, I don't think it's a terrible matchup for either it, it's player. A, it's a toss-up. It's a toss-up right now because we, we have no idea. We have no idea how good that Pichu is yet, but we have no idea how hard it's going to be for us to deal with Quid. Yeah. It, it could take, like right now we have nine people, or nine stocks. It might take three of our stocks to deal with one of his. So at this point on, theoretically, one of our stock or three of our stocks did one of his we'd go even with them right now yeah so we'll see how that goes we just need someone to really come in and pack a punch on that guy and shake him up a little bit and take this game one up three is really big that's huge i think we're going to Kalos. this might be a pichu this is pichu all right, looks like they're anchoring Quid. So, I'm this. This would definitely be more concerning. I feel like if it was Pikachu over Pichu because Quick Dash that actually does damage, or the Quick Attack actually does damage as Pikachu. So I'm wondering how this Pichu is going to approach, other than Lightning Ball, because it just gets canceled out by Shuriken. And it just does damage to Pichu. Okay, so it doesn't look like he can crouch under Shuriken. Oh, missing the com missing out on the combo opportunity. 
theoretically, as, as long as Landon just keeps camping this Pichu out, this Pichu will just gain its own percent. So it would be camping against this Pichu would be just really beneficial overall in the long in the long run. It'll just be a really long game. And then getting center stage. Ooh, narrowly avoiding that grab. Let's see. Caster mic is still working. I think I fixed it, so that's good. And then throwing out these options that just linger for a long time against these players and this this Pichu is now he's choosing Landon's choosing some stress options right now he's getting punished for a little bit but he's gonna get back on his feet here real quick got yes. back into the corner uh, trying to catch a jump with that side B not successful yet that was correct oh Ooh. Yep. that's what that's what will happen against Pichu at 80% in the corner they rip a move and it was a reason the character damages it, himself yeah. oh, I thought that was about to work again almost did the character is just so powerful. Now, this Pichu has dropped combos, I think, a, a, quite a bit. I wonder if it's... I'm not sure if it's because Landon's DI is just immaculate, or if it's potentially just online. But we are falling out of combos, and it's keeping us alive. That's a stock. And Continuing are... our lead here at Manchester right now against the best team in the country. One of the best teams in the country. That was some weird. Ooh, going for, trying to get the quick stock landing, trying to get the cheese. Ooh, big, big damage coming, coming their way. Both players are now starting to throw out some lingering moves, trying to just get these stocks. Pichu consistently using back air as a ledge guarding option. This is the percent that we want to get that grab at. He's fishing exactly. for it right now as we speak. Here we go. Ooh! Misses the grab. Ooh! That was a good air dodge. Disengages. He's out. Disengages again. He's out. Oh, but he goes back in. He wanted that grab too. Misses again. Gets up smashed. That's unfortunate, but this is exactly the percent that I, I still think down throw up air could still potentially work. Maybe not now. And then going for Landon wants this stock. Landon knows that if he can take this stock right now, then this Pichu is probably it's going to be lights out for this Pichu. Oh, Landon is now locked. Landon's locked in. <laughs> Assisting the recovery. Unfortunate, but. Nice. And there's the stop. That's us. They only have four stocks as of now. You're still up by that three. And putting this Pichu off stage. Beautiful Ooh. damage. This is really big for us because catching this Pichu player is really big, really big damage here. The 50%. more damage we can get on, the closer that we're going to Ooh. The closer we're gonna get to this grab. Now this this is he the wants the grab. He, knows it. he, he knows wants it. the grab. Not yet, not yet. He DI'd correctly. Pichu knows the matchup for the most part. And then has he is playing beautifully right now super patient this is going super well just needs to keep it up those side are getting a little overzealous but that's okay oh my Ooh! goodness oh catch catching him that's crazy we are four stocks ahead four stocks ahead. this is big so this is that moment that we're talking about i my guess okay i guess it wasn't more of a guess it was more of like a nine stocks to quid's three how many well now we only have seven so how many is quid going to be able to take from us before we can take three from him that's that's going to be really big it'd be 
it sh it'd be huge if Landon goes in there with this one stock and just and takes, takes one. one. Just takes one. one. Yep. That would be crazy. That was that was huge for 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 Manchester. Landon's play was amazing. Wait, did you say quid? Yeah. Yep. Yep. Quid. We're gonna be facing quid. More than likely, it's. I think quid, it's quid, guaranteed. Quid, quid it's goes guaranteed. in here. Yeah. Quid, this is their. I mean, they should have sent him in earlier. I think. Uh, but I, once I think they saw they the potential from the sword fighter. Yeah. Uh, but definitely gonna anchor for them. So we have seven against quids three. We'll see how that goes. Imagine quids like, sword fighter. Don't put me against sword fighter. That's fine. That'd be crazy. At that point, that means he's going to, and our sword fighter can beat everybody here, it looks like. So, we've only lost we have Fleet Fleetwood. Yeah. We've only Fleet lost Fleetwood. We have... Fleetwood Scrub. Who oh. we have left? We got the Augment. We got the Duck 190. Grimbo. And Grimbo, if we want to play the Grimbo for the mix-up on the Prana Plant. And it's Quid. This is... This is gonna be huge. Wow, that that took a little bit to load. Why is is that door broke? All right, Landon. <laughs> I got, I got. All right, here we go. It's just gonna be big. All right, uh, Landon needs to SD one oh. time. There we go. I think. You know what? Imagine doesn't switch off Squirtle until 60% but landing gets a grab. Okay. So we already see hyper aggression coming from Quid. Let's see where that goes. I think I think he knows you don't want to camp out this sword fighter. Throwing out really good options. It is. Uh, he, he chose the best skin. I'm not gonna lie. All right. So. We're definitely getting a lot of pressure here from this guy. Not letting land and do anything. You can tell that he's just very solid, just like in general with his movement. Um, very, very practiced. And um, Landon's catching it though. He knows his opportunities. Yeah, he is. He is catching him. One down throw up air. I think. I think that'd be a stock. We're gonna see a switch really soon, like really, really soon, because he can't really afford to drop a stock here. Um, so he, he's gonna have to switch to these heavier guys once he gets to these later percents so that he doesn't die. Land is not committing hard to anything right now. <laughs> I, that has me a bit lost. Land is not committing very hard into anything because he knows if he messes up once, that's going to mean a stock. And I don't think that really matters. I don't think it matters what percent. Ooh. Understandable. So yeah. what, what, uh, what did he do, do there? Well, I, don't, I, didn't, I didn't get to see the starter. It was combo. Leaf Blade and Leaf Blade, okay. yep. Which just magically connected. That was crazy. And that's fine here. So this is what we're going to see. We're going to see... Um, we're going to see multiple things here. They're going to probably discuss uh, sending okay. in the Augment. And then maybe the Anchoring the Duck 190. But... On the off chance that we think that we're going to be able to <laughs> take their three stocks before we need, need yeah. before we need another person, we might keep the last person, you know, like a secret. Not like a secret, but keep their habits unknown. We'll see how that goes. I think I we're think, seeing the Terry here, but I definitely think we're gonna see the augment sends. And it'll be we have we're three we're three stocks ahead. We still have all of our players are solid, but we have two oh, yeah, for sure. we have two extremely solid players. No, it is not over. This is this is game oh, what's one. What's up, Uh We have very solid players that are going it's, to have to all si all six stocks are going to be used to anchor against Quid. Most likely, that's that's the assumption. Anyways, it's six to three, Tharpy. We're up three. Quid still has three. We're gonna have to go through him with uh, augment and duck one ninety, unless we give a. Matt send, which would be crazy. I, I don't think we'll see a Matt send just because PT is just too good of a character and he's too good of a player piloting that character. Oh, yeah. That's just too much of a skill diff, and it looks like we're getting the augment. Looks like we're getting the augment, as foretold. I think there's also a lot of potential for Grimbo to start there's potential any there. of these games because yeah. 
for sure. Starting starting Grimbo, starting a Piranha Plant is extremely hard, and I think I'm not sure what characters would fall hard to Piranha Plant, and all of them seem to be fairly rounded in most matchups. Yeah. I don't think Piranha Plant's yeah. near as uncommon as Sword Fighter. So that's there's, there's potential. Hard. Yeah. All right. There was a communication error, so they are remaking the lobby right now. But we know it's Og versus Quid. We just got to get there. Og versus Quid. This is Terry versus PT. The thing about PT is that they die very, very early if you stay Squirtle. So there's a potential that Og oh, yeah. gets like a Nair at like 50 into another Nair into a side B, and that's a stock from Quid off the side. And that'd be amazing to see here. Are they best of three? Best of three CBs? Yep, yep these yep, are all best yeah, of three. Are. And this is the previous winner of all of the uh, NACE. Not all of the NACE, the past two years of NACE. So yep. uh, the, oh, best, the best team in the U.S. at the moment. Yo, I think I think Aug's got this. I think next next game, Aug's definitely, like, Aug may not, Aug's locked in. Aug locks in very quickly. Yep. But game two, I don't think, I don't think Aug could be any better than than he would ever be in like a game, a game two or a game three. Yeah, he just got to keep his composure. He's gonna have to stay calm here, because uh, like you know, there's so much momentum that this guy can get. The nice thing too, Charizard, that tail hitbox with Terry. I think that's that's got a lot of potential for us. Look at that. That's a nice trade that we like. Nice little twenty. Ooh. Oh my goodness. All right, that guy DI'd out, and this actually looked really, really bad. That was a good recovery from Hog. No, good job knowing that, he that water gun was coming. That's very, very smart for him. He does that? Like, have like this, like it, a it can two pick frame up effect? Terry's legs beneath the stage if he doesn't do it correctly. That's why Quiz already looking for it. And it's like he got it. Ooh, that was I, terrifying. Insane. He barely missed it. Og is going to be very wary of that from now on, though. Because now he's recognizing that that's, that thing has potential to just take his stock for free. So, very, very scary. Hopefully he can keep his composure and lock in and take these stocks here though. What we're seeing, this is this is a switch, so definitely Ooh! That was a very beautiful hit. 108 onto the Ivy Sword. Onto the PT. This is really big here. This is a good Ooh, good chase. That was a really ooh. good chase. Waited for the one roll, waited for the second Og, taking a breath. Keeping his composure. He's got two more stocks to deal with to take game one. And he knows that he can do it. Um, he's seeing that the Squirtle is STIing out of that jab. He's gonna Not have to be more patient on letting loose the tower. Uh, uh, Joe is online. Joe is online. He's got 126 with some good rage. So a big combo here is a lot of damage. That's so huge grab. Doesn't go for anything. He didn't go for like a go punish. He just wanted to grab, and that's okay. We still get damage from it. We're 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 ahead we by ahead. four whole stocks now. August knows that he does not need to play very aggressively for us to be able to win this. This is some really good damage here. Ooh. Beautiful combo. Goes a little zealous with that up smash. That was going to be really, really good if that hit, but... That would uh, crazy. Sadly, it doesn't put it. We're not so we got Going for it. the shield break string. I'm not sure what you want to call it, but I've seen all pop the shield back air, before. Back air, no. Ooh! Is this a stock That's a stock. That's a stock. That's crazy. All playing... Aug playing out of his mind already game one. Aug's playing great. This is absolutely beautiful here. We can definitely see some crazy potential. Especially if we can get this last stock. We have five to deal with one stock. This is looking like a round one to Manchester. I don't want to speak too soon, but that's what it's looking like to me. We are playing very, very safe. And honestly, like looking at looking at the Augment several stocks ahead versus Aug several stocks down is so crazy going for the early stock that oh that's he the beats quid that's the elucifer right he there beats quid that is the elucifer where's our elucifer she and chat we need our elucifer here manchester is up absolutely game beautiful game one game one goes crazy. to manchester insane yo tharpy yeah that was <laughs> they were both three stocks three stocks right August just beat Quid. Three stocks to three stocks. That is insane. Aug that just, is crazy. He just not only beat a pro player, he just beat a pro player with only dropping a singular stock.
Wait. They've won the past two years. They have. And we just won game one by five stocks. We just won game this one is, by five stocks. This is huge. They no longer know about two of our players. We have two players that we can send in, and they have no idea how they're going to play. Yo, who, who does what's that? up, Apple? Oh, it's Apple. Yeah. Apple's a mod? Apple, you're a mod? Is that what the red means? No, that's what the green is. Oh, that's crazy. Wait, Apple. <laughs> Apple's just a Yo, mod. Yo, what's up, Elucifer? That's crazy. Augment hit the Elucifer to finish off game one. Why Yo, is Apple a mod? I'm a mod everywhere I go. That's crazy. <laughs> No, that's but wild. they don't know about two of our guys. Exactly. And like, like a, th that was like the best case scenario that I was talking Manchester about. Manchester now has this fear factor about us too. We now have, they they have a reason to fear us. We just took game one. August continues to just randomly get crazy wins. He does. He does. August is insane. But now, now it's huge to have a game plan. So I think they're definitely talking right now. <laughs> Lucifer, yes, all caps. It's definitely important to have a game plan right now. So, like, very important. This is like, this is huge. So, what we're gonna do is we're probably gonna send in the Landon first. Oh, I, I mean, because did we though, or do we reserve him for Sonic? Well, that's the thing is that Landon went against the Pichu as well, right? And you're took right, all three from right. Pichu and only had only had two to work with. So, he lost one to the Sonic, one to the Pichu, and who knows what he would have done against the Mega Man. But it looks like Landon. We already can see with how he did last game. He's a great. He's a great lead. Wow, that's what yeah. I'm expecting here. But we might. We might just send. We might just rinse repeat. We I was thinking. Just, we oh, is, that a, is that a is that a duck going in? That that's that looks like a duck getting ready. Sending in the player that we haven't even played yet as a mix-up. That's crazy. I like it. That's crazy. That's pretty good. See, we have. Is it just? Duck and Grimbo, those two players it that they don't know about. It is just Duck and Grimbo. So if we're playing the Duck here, we're most likely, sadly, not going to see Grimbo unless we want to mix up and like he has like a really good matchup that he wants to go in on here. Could potentially go game three, too. Okay. And we might want to mix up mm -hmm. for start two. Because, ooh, okay. ooh, that's right. They show their character. We show ours. So we, we're, we're locked in here. We're not changing. They're not changing. Everything's locked. Diddy Kong versus Pichu. I don't think that's... I don't think it's terrible, but it's, I don't think it's good for Diddy Kong. The problem here is I think they're going to go to Town and City, which oh, which might be the reason they sent the Pichu. Uh, it's really scary. That's like probably Pichu's best stage, if not yeah. second best stage. Oh, we might be swapping here. Either way, Manchester going crazy. If anybody's here is just tuning in, let's go. Duck. Manchester took game one, five stocks uh, remaining in game one that we didn't have to use. Augment going insane, beating Quid, only dropping one stock to Quid. So beautiful. I mean, what can we really? What can you even say? Manchester's just the best. Now, I think they. The question is, do they anchor again? I think they throw quit out the quit. second landing comes in. So the I mean, yeah, I mean we were talking about it before. I think they should have sent Quid in much earlier. Yeah. Once they saw the threat of the, the Mii Sword Fighter and the team not really knowing the counterplay. Or just not really knowing they, they didn't look like they had experience against Sword Fighter. And but who knows? Quid might be in the exact same boat. He's like, I've never played a Sword Fighter ever. Who knows? And he doesn't want to waste his stocks on a matchup he's never played and maybe use his pawns to whittle down Oh, you're gonna call him his pawns? That's crazy. It, I mean, it it's not like a in, in a narcissistic way, more of like a quid is so crazy. much better than yeah. everybody in this entire league that I mean you can only look at it in that way. So clearly not though, because Augment just destroyed him. I guess. So we're who's, gonna who's the real pawn? You're right, you're right. <laughs> Augment new is gonna win a major next year. That's just what's gonna happen. He's not going to be at Manchester, and he's going to be winning majors. Augment travels. Me, James, and Augment are all going to be traveling once we're out of college. We're going to go to a major all together, stay in a room together like the good old days, and one of us will win. And, fun fact, if me and Augment get to grand finals together at a major, James will say the F word for the first time in his entire life. He said that. Did he, he say he was gonna do he, that? He he promised us. We we said James, 
because he, he was like, I'll never say it, I'll never say it ever. And we were like, me and August were like, so what do we have to do to, to get you to say it one day? He said, if you and Colin are in grand finals of a major fighting each other, he will say the F word in the crowd. He'll drop the bomb. That's he'll crazy. Drop the, he'll drop that's the F crazy. bomb for the first time ever. And it, it doesn't sound like a lot, but that's a pretty big deal. So, you know, we got to work. We got to work towards right. it. We got to yeah. get there. I think going, going back to Smash, right? I think yeah, going he's, back choosing, to he's choosing music right now. All right, yeah, they're he, choosing music they're, right they're, now. They're taking their sweet time. They're taking their sweet Let's time. Let's see. What, what music does Clay pick? Mega Man? Mega Man music? Uh, X is zero. I don't know what song that is. What would you say? F zero. X, like I don't know. Look Japanese. Japanese. Oh, I can I can tell you I didn't see it. All right. Regardless, it's Mega Man music, and it roughly sounds the same. So, Flea went Steve or Minmin. Flea went Minmin. Yeah. They already answered. Uh, the Lucifer answered. Big thing. Uh, big thing. Does this peach you know how to use banana? That's gonna be huge. Uh, so one thing that we'll see is if they land a banana. Especially at higher percents, probably later, um, they can run up F tilt, like pivot oh, F tilt yeah, to that's... get that range. Um, Diddy will die at like, oh man, even after the nerf, probably at like 110, something like that. So we'll see if they even get into that spot. We see the banana already. Not a lot of damage to come from it though. I mean, just Definitely. look at look at the Peach's percent, just slowly climbing on its own. I I love the animation and how. Pichu actually grabs a banana with her mouth. I think that's that's yeah. just really cool game design. It's always yeah, I always love that. It's amazing because the the arms are too short for her to to throw the banana to, to pick yeah. anything up. Yeah, like a pattern. Smash like a has exaggerated T-Rex. animation, but that'd be way too much. All right. Um, oh, that jab lock didn't hit. If that jab lock hit, that was a stock. But this got the rule before. Uh, this feels very before. even. And you know, we, we talk all the time about how how Aug and how Landon are just super good players, but sometimes sometimes Duck is left in the dark a little bit. Duck is a, probably one of our craziest players. Ooh, and that's that's something we need to watch out for. That was a lesson learned right there. That was a lesson learned. So we the Pichu knew that interaction would happen for the most part. That's why they continued to just spam that move on the ledge right there. So and now Duck is definitely made aware. How much of a threat that is, so we'll definitely be looking to avoid that. Already 42% on the duck here. This Pichu is getting a little bit of a lead, but it is Pichu, so anything can happen. And we can take the stock Ooh. at any percent, get a little delay for that X Smash there. If okay. Duck hadn't have grabbed that banana, that would have been a trip too, since Pichu was coming in hot, about to land on it. We're gonna look for a down tilt up smash here. Hopefully, maybe even just a down tilt back here. Um, just gonna have to secure the stock in one way or another. See the banana come out. Doesn't get it to land yet. Has it again. This peach is doing very well at staying in the air to avoid getting hit by this banana. Yeah, I was gonna say, this is a very aerial. Or at least just in this game, at least. Just because of banana. Just staying in the air is very important. I think I think if Duck was more patient to, to stuff out the landing, almost baiting like the landing. Ooh! That's really crazy. good, really good stock from the Pichu. Pichu this Pichu is playing very well right now. Clay's gonna have to lock in and take this stock. If we take one here, that's nothing to be crazy. But this Pichu has a lot of momentum. We might not take one, and that's fine. I have nothing to be super scared of. And that's there one. it is. There's one. I had to say it so that it would happen. You know, I had to say it wouldn't, have, so it would. We have, uh, what is it? O Ozark. Ozarks? Olzar, Olzar, the great Olzar, the fortune teller. Oh, the guy. fortune teller, yeah. Give me your money. <laughs> that is I'll you. I'll tell you a fortune. I think if we if we really just waited to stuff out these landings, I think we do. The, ooh, recatching banana. That's crazy. I think the problem is right that there. They're, they're in the air so much, and they're landing so safely that everything is being everything is really hard to punish. That's such that's such a crazy. I think animation. the answer here is low key. Like if we're not see like that right there, that that side beat with the kick, that was definitely an opportunity. This, but even that didn't land. Pichu's just so hard to hit, and I, I think Pichu's also trying to react to um, react to the DI option. So I think that's why this Pichu has missed almost. I think every single down throw. There's a pivot up tilt. Yep. We we were kind of expecting that. Um, 
that's okay. so broken. That, I think that's probably one of the best forward tilts in the game. Trips at early percentages and just straight up kills at 100 from side stage. Yeah. That's crazy. So, we'll probably save the augment. We... My guess is we will see the... He needed to be grabbing. Yeah, he Duck did. Is amazing. It, they definitely need. They could have grabbed. I mean, they were conditioning the the shield so much, especially on the landing, and we didn't see a lot of the side bees come out. But the Pichu was in the air like ninety percent of the game, so even landing that grab was going to be difficult. Duck even punished all, like quite a few jumps, but did he just doesn't have many options to just throw out in the air, especially since Duck had to double jump half the time to get up there. Yeah, I wouldn't say this round's over. I mean, at the end of the day, it's a Pichu, and we could just evaporate these stocks if we're playing well. The Pichu wasn't playing this well last round. I think it legit is just the matchup being like that. I think Clay could have camped a lot more. Playing, They were playing very aggressive. I think they yeah. could have just been more patient. Who is this? Is from this, the get-go. Is this a Matt? Okay, they, they walked away. I'm not sure who that was. Right. What's up, Cookie? The evil cookie one seven three, welcome. I, I definitely, I definitely feel like, you know, when you're playing against like Landon, too, because that's that's who the peach you played last game. Like there's, he throws stars. You jump. Yep. He stuffs out your landing. Yep. Did he? He wants you to land. He wants to throw a banana at you. So that's. That was definitely hard since really Clay didn't get to see the Pichu really play the game more as get camped out. Not really, yeah. You're right. So and that was almost like a coming into the match raw. I think the same goes for... Yes, no, this is the school of Quid. We're yeah. up 1-0 against them. We had five stocks left remaining in the last round. And Aug ended up beating Quid with two stocks remaining, which is crazy. Aug going in with three, and then into Quid's three. So yep. very, very important for Manchester. Yeah, this is huge. This is massive here. They're hyped. They're locked in. They're not down about anything. They're, they're, they're ready to to bring up their A game. Yeah, this is really huge. I think there is this. I don't know. If I was out there, I would have. Probably, I don't know. I might even just go in against Pichu, to be honest, as Kazuya. Yeah, that'd be. But the thing <laughs> is, like, it, I, I'd be. A, blow up. I'm a hard send here, regardless. I don't know if I would even play in this matchup just because they have a Sonic. Even though I never lose to any Sonics besides Sonics himself, he's the only Sonic that's like. He's the only Sonic that's ever beaten me. I've never lost another. I mean, I haven't lot. I haven't fought a lot in bracket, but. I was gonna say, I think. I fought him down in, down in Arlington, Texas. That's crazy. Oh. Year. In bracket, yeah. Oh, because Fishers, right? Um, yeah, Fishers was there, but there was a there was a there was a local there with like four hundred people, and he was in it. I think he ended up winning, but I played him round two. So that's crazy. Now, yeah. now Sonics is almost beating everybody. So yeah, now they're the best. Or Ecola is the best. Is Sonic the best, or is it Ecola? I mean, Zamba just beat Sonic, so I guess you can't really even say. Yeah. But at oh, that right. point, forever that. Fight my Sonic with Wolfie. Wolfie, That's bro, crazy. I'd love to fight your Sonic. Oh, genuinely. Sending in Landon. All right, locking in. All right, I think this is a very good send. I think Quid gets sent afterwards. Oh, Cookie Landon is sent. Okay. Holy shit, we have a lot of like, we have a oh, lot shoot. of people here. We have Cheering a lot of good this people. Is, yeah, this is crazy. Sorry, it's part of my part of my French, guys. Part of my French. I can't be speaking French on stream. It's not allowed. We're down two stocks, which isn't huge. We were just up five, so this is kind of crazy. All right, two on the Pichu. We're down by two. We have three of the scrub. Um, by the way, for everyone that's here that didn't get to see the last round, I think the scrub took, um, what was it? Um, it was two, three, it was five. The scrub took five. The scrub took, did the scrub take eight last round? He took was that eight? Pichu, Sonic, and one away from one so away from seven. 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 That's crazy. Seven stocks last round. We so have playing 20, very hot. We have twenty-one people on stream right now, so we have quite we have quite the viewage. 
which is kind of crazy. Pichu going it. That was insane. Yep, that's how it goes. That's just that's that's just the reality of the matchup. That's what this character does. But we get the stock, we steal it right back. One more onto the Pichu. I full-heartedly believe that we take this stock without dropping another one. Uh, I don't think we're going to get cheese like that one again. And that, it, it, that's correct. We'll have two going into the next. I, I didn't think, like, that was that was not near as, like, that wasn't not near as much cheese as well, what I, Pichu I, played. That was, was in the crazy. way. What did he hit him with? Uh, he went for a down air spike, and when he missed, he covered the ledge grab with Back the air? down special. Oh, okay. So it just dragged okay. him down. It yeah. is spike. But it was just powerful and killed since yeah. it's so deep. Ooh! Landon with the read. Landon, Landon's locked in. They know how important this, this win would be. Landon gets the correct DI. So avoiding that one again. <coughs> we can definitely see the 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 down B cheese factor is definitely online. Already took one stock and going off deep to get that second one as well. This player, this Pichu player wants it really badly because that would mean, that would mean that's another an stock. stock. Getting hit by that at like almost any. Percent. That's crazy. That's that's stock. No, when there, when there's, when there, oh, that's so good. Is <laughs> is lots? All these plays are just making me gasp because this, this is close. Because if we, we we want Landon to keep these two stocks because that'd be very important. And this Pichu, this Pichu is just like, throwing really good options. Crazy. Really good tech roll. Amazing that was really tech. Good. If Landon didn't tech that, that would have probably potentially uh, been dead. This Pichu I think really... we're about to see. Ooh! That's crazy. Wow. Wait. Wow, Pichu. The thing is, I actually yeah. lost track of the percent that Pichu was getting to. Because Pichu was actually just damaging himself for the past 30 seconds. Pichu. And racked on a good 20% onto himself. Wow. He, he took on a lot of percent just trying to camp. Yep. I mean, that's that's just how it goes. That's just that's just the Pichu. And I think that's why this matchup is so... I think that's why we're trying to send the land in the, into that. Just yeah. because he can Landon just out camp. Can camp yeah. And not to give himself damage, yep. which is crazy. And, uh, you know, we lost... We dropped the one stock, but... I I think watching... Watching trade. Watching one this... One for two. 100%. Watching this makes me, makes me think about the matchup and how it should be played. Yeah. And honestly, like, I don't, Joker doesn't do good. I mean, Joker, right? So Joker does not go good in a Pichu. But if I wanted to win, what I should do is just camp Pichu out and let that Pichu just rack up percent. Yeah. Because that's what would lead me to it. That, that would be, that's like a whole other win factor is just letting Pichu damage herself. Well done, Gribboma. Yo, they are doing amazing work tonight. This is really huge this because is, if we're able to keep carrying this momentum and have the augment beat the quid again, I, I, be crazy. albeit quid is probably theory crafting in his head like what he needs to do to beat this Terry right now. That he, was that was a pretty brutal match. He already he already pretty much had locked down how to beat quid, uh, how to beat augment yeah. the Terry getting the getting the scoop off his legs, yeah. almost killing him at 40% yeah, cause we, for free. Yeah. That was crazy. Almost got it. And he actually, if he was a little bit faster on that, on reacting to, like, uh, actually hitting him with a water gun. We're dead. Wait, we're going back to Kalos? Who Who's taking us to Kalos here? Oh, wait, I'm confused. Must be a random peach. <laughs> Not random, but the, the sub peach. Ooh! I Wade. called it. Okay. Quid is so coming Quid into come landing. In. So this is what should have happened last round when they saw the sword fighter and, and the destruction that he happening. did. And now it is they they did correct their their decision making and send in the quid against the landing. This is going to be a very good match, very high quality gameplay here. This is gonna be awesome. We we'll see we we'll see Landon's gum. I think Landon's locked in. Landon reminds me of a cartoon character right now. I don't know what cartoon character Landon's reminding me of right now, but it's there. It's, it's, it's the mouth. It's the glasses. We see that immediate aggression again right off the bat. Alright. I'm not sure... You know, Squirtle? When when using Squirtle, the, the, the grab, the down air, like his combo spread is always different. And so, not having uh, me Swordfighter matchup experience, he 
probably, honestly, you probably check that out before even entering this match of what the combo spread looked like for any sword fighter. But what's, what Squirtle has to do to his opponents is different based on weight, ball speed. It's always different for every character. And it seems like he's got it on lockdown. So there's definitely a bit of studying behind the scenes. Unless he just knows the me sword fighter uh the me sword fighter like one thing you can do is kind of just know the general weight the weight class they're in oh that was really good di here oh that was so beautiful that was like that was a really hard situation to get back from and he managed to do it that side b actually like carrying him back back all the way to the stage from the blast zone that was really far that was really good we're getting some vine whips here we're gonna try to get a vine whip up into either up the Try to go for a down smash there to catch the recovery path, but there's the upper coming out that we kind of expected. We have three quid stocks coming in. Hot, we get the down throw. We don't get the backer or the bear, but that's okay. They know they, they know to avoid that. Ooh, but quid actually rolls in. That was a really I don't know, that was a very stressful roll. I because think Quid tried to almost time when Landon would do it, but Landon's honestly just waiting for you to yeah, Landon pick an is option. Just waiting to see anything. He so just lets it rip. Landon definitely takes a stock. Right, Landon. Landon probably doesn't. Oh, like that's. Oh, I thought that was gonna be it, but it's not quite yet. He still has a jump that whole. That was crazy. Time. <laughs> well, he he did a he he grabbed ledge and just jumped off. I don't know how he had a jump. Not thinking about it. So, Landon obviously took one. We sent we sent Ogden next. That's. I feel like that's almost guaranteed. That was scary. I feel like Landon still has potential to take this. I mean, we still have the upbeat factor, you know? We get him off stage once, there's a potential that we he just wants, he really upbeat cheese, that's it. Yeah. So that, that's just a broken confirm. Uh, that's 100% true. If you get smacked by that downer, falling up air through the plot will always land. Shout outs to Quidstopher. Shout outs uh, to Quidstopher. Quidstopher is going down today. Uh, stream went dark, not sure. If it's us or I mean they're not looking like there was a problem out there. Yeah. I might have to go out there and see. Yeah, you wanna run out there real quick? Disconnected here. Yeah, so we we're getting the Og sense. We see Og, I see the go banana shirt. Maybe it's not Og. Um Still have no connection. Colin's going out there to check that. But Og last time took three stocks while still maintaining two. And so you know, Quid, Quid semi, he's a semi pro or pro player. And so he can adapt really fast. And, you know, because that's, that's kind of the job with these players. They, they need to adapt quickly. So I could, I, I think August still comes out of here winning. I think August still wins these. Who won the first game? Uh, Manchester is up 1 0, and it's six stocks, Manchester, Stony Brook, eight. So Manchester won first game, which is crazy. We had five stocks left. Um, Og went with his three into Quid with his three, and Og came out with two stocks, which is insane. Um, definitely an upset, to say the least. And I think that'd have been crazy if it happened in a tournament setting. We good? Nah. All right. Uh, it's black. So it's teleported. Oh, he's gone. So there's definitely a lot to look forward to in this match. Um, I think I, I, I think Og makes it out of here, right? Um, we have Grimbo. We have James who went in game one and ended up taking I think four. All of our guys took a lot of stocks, except Og, because he went in for the last three, but still maintained his two. So we just have a lot of people we could throw in. So as long as we know the character, I think we're almost ahead in a way, because now Quid's gone, and it's between Sonic, Peach, and there's three Ps. There's three P Nope, Pokemon Trainer gone, Pichu gone. We have Sonic, they have a Sonic left, they have a Peach left, I feel like I miss, I'm missing something, I'm missing something. 
and they have oh a Mega Man. They have a Mega Man left. So really, we prepare for the campy characters because that's all that's left, and that's only consider. <laughs> What's up, Matt? And that's that's only considering if they even put in. Um, that's only considering if they put in the peach and no quit is not out now quit is at two stocks right now um what were quid was out last game from august august is going into quid now august cam just came back in still the game oh game just came back so that's big all right perfect i think I think we lost connection because we just got into an arena. W Aug, yo Aug is so so good. He's not Indiana PR, but that's just because he doesn't go to tournaments. I think Aug could potentially be like top three if he would just go to as many tournaments as he could. Because Aug is just Aug is a crazy player. We're theory crafting jab lock combos, and he's just crazy zero deaths. Anyway, Aug's coming in next, of course. Uh, they're banning stages right now, so I do think I do think table got hit. That's why it went dark. So I think I think we just got in. That's what the delays for. So that one combo he got on scrubbed on Manchester Monday's grands was insane. I wasn't there to watch that, unfortunately, and I've yet to see it. I do believe that Aug just recently started uploading content to his YouTube channel and the YouTube shorts because he'll clip us, he'll clip Doc, he'll clip Scrubbed, and then he'll put some cool music and stuff in and just post it like that. And then he won't post for like, he probably won't post for like another month unless he posts the grand final clip. But he makes, he makes Terry look so good. I can 100% do this again. I wonder where Colin went. So here we go. Aug's at three stocks. Quid has two. Manchester is down two stocks right now, but we won game one, and August beat them last time. For those who haven't heard me say that for the millionth time already, all right, quid switching skins. That is something I noticed. Not not the same skin that I complimented earlier. All right, all coming in big, understanding that quid is extremely aggressive. Quid coming in with the combo. Quid not going for the typical the typical catch on the up up special recovery. Quit doing that the wrong way. This is big damage. Huge punish from Aug. Oh yeah, it looks like we're at 30 frames now. Yeah, the frame rate definitely went down. Or at least maybe it's just the monitor here. It's just the monitor. Oh, got the spike! That is insane! That's huge. That is actually huge. Quid's mad. Quid doesn't want to approach. Quid is furious. That's potential game. Like, that could. That's potentially what could lose a game. I think. I think Quid, Quid, is, is, trying, Quid is trying to cool off. I. If. If I. If that happened to me, I'd have to. I'd have to take a breather too from side stage and do nothing. It's grabbed. We might see a stop here. It's kind of hard to make it back against Ivy. Great. Ooh, great ooh, recovery. Good attack! The attack was huge! It was a really good recovery. Because we still have go. We do not have go anymore. But still two stocks away, it's even. This could potent. He does not want Aug anywhere near him. You know, I feel like Terry's also fairly good on Kalos. I'm surprised they didn't choose a stage of more platforms. August not getting anything from that, unfortunately. Quid being very safe. Aug might benefit from some aerial power waves here. An odd F smash, definitely. Just Ooh, that was I a thought good we were going to see a potential shield, shield break. Insane. Quid catches is him, even on the SDIN, still catches him. Because he was waiting on that down B to rip it. Aug is playing extremely pink. Almost I thought... The stock. That would have been the stock that landed. That's crazy. 
has the Switch. Waits it out. We have the Switch here. Ivy is out. The thing about Ivy now is that if we get this Nair on this platform, that is probably game. Just one Nair here. Okay, still at 75, we're pretty healthy. Oh, he's not gonna get risky, not even gonna go near the ledge. Doesn't wanna get cheese, doesn't wanna get reversal. Shields that upbeat and then dash attacks. What a beautiful dash attack. Barely, barely surviving, okay, barely. A little living. bit of an early pop off from the crowd, but that's okay. I think Quid is looking, looking for a ooh, learning from last time. I think Quid was looking for a reversal. Get, oh man, we would have had that jab. Wait, are we gonna get the jab here? Nope. That's okay. all going for a read. That would have been crazy. Beautiful dash attack. And ending the same way it did last time. That is crazy. Quid out of the way. Guess how many stocks Quid take? <laughs> Quid has Took taken four stocks from Manchester in total. 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 Wait, how how many did he take from Landon? He only took two. He only took three he stocks. Took, he took one from this Landon. game. He took three stocks this game. No, two. Oh, I meant I meant last round. Oh, he took two. He took two from Scrub. Because he round? only. He only took one from Scrubbed, right? No, he took two from Scrubbed. You're right. Yeah, you're right, you're right. But Aug still having two stocks. I think they definitely send in, like, Sonic into Terry. The intangibility, like, four moves. Yo, I don't know how Aug lived what he did, but... We got Jax up in here, too. It's crazy. There's a lot of the Indiana's finest in here. This is awesome. You think you think it's a uh, Sonic sense? Sonic or against Terry? Terry. I mean, I guess they have the lead by one stock. They're probably gonna send in their biggest camper, so probably Mega Sonic Man. to keep it going here. Let's go, Og. Sea dudes in go. here as well. Oh, we, oh, we definitely got that Indiana post. Yeah. We definitely got that at everyone in the Indiana Discord, didn't we? Indiana is hyping us up right now. <laughs> Twenty-eight people. We're almost about to hit thirty people watching the stream all at once. That is crazy. Og moment. Yeah. Og moment. <laughs> yeah. Yo, Og is, Og is playing crazy today. Also, another thing to note, if they were to send in Sonic, I, I think about it, Riddles plays Terry into Sonic. So I'm, he does play Terry. I mean, it, it's it's not like he likes Terry in a Sonic. He, he's mentioned it's it before. It's just better. It's better than Kazuya. It's better than Kazuya. It's better than Kazuya. But it's still, Kazuya's not even that bad. Like... I guess he sends Terry into Sonics, yeah, which is the best Sonic. So, I guess I think they're thinking. I don't think they've chosen a character yet. Still working on stage bands because it, it's really like I don't think we we haven't really seen the Mega Man play either because Mega they, Man had they, to play. They went against the Min, -Min. The Min, Min and we still have the Min Min in storage right now. <laughs> We can pull so, up that Min Min any time. Yeah, no, we're probably going to see him come out after this. This three 100%. stocks. After August, two stocks go by here. Um, we, we, unironically, we have only seen two of Augment's stocks. It's a Mega so Man. Far. All right, you were right. We only have two of the Augment stocks so far. Because he still has two from Quid, and he still had two from Quid before that we ended the first round with. We didn't yeah. even get to see what he would have done against the other people. So we have no idea how this is going to go. He could take every stock here with just the two. He could. He could. Uh, I'm not sure. You know, I'm not sure our Mega Man matchup. I'm, I'm a huge Mega Man fan. I plan on secondary Mega Man, but <laughs> it's not good. I'm wondering if we're going to see a lot more saw blade tech. I wonder if we're going to see a lot more setups from the side special. I think there's a I think there's a lot of different things that this Mega Man is gonna do in this game because he's not playing a character like Min Min who changes the game. Makes you camp, makes you play so far. Definitely. I mean it's funny that he just jabbed him. And you're like expecting the power dunk, right? But he still did 12 damage. What no. was that movement? That was crazy. That was the aug shoot. <laughs> that was that's the, uh, the that looks really spike cool. hitbox of the crack shoot. That looked really cool. Because he just slid across stage. Oh, we're getting some damage here. Alright. There's a triple in there. I think Leaf Shield is definitely stopping Hog from coming in. That's a really a good lot. back area. Really good recovery, though. 
I think Kalos would have probably been the best option against a Terry because his down special, like, Aug has nowhere to go except up. Hmm. Ooh, crazy. All right, good back catching, here. Catching Can't be too mad at that. Playing very well. Four. Almost getting that stock, it looked like. He's fishing for this stock here. He knows that he's at 4% for a majority of his combos here, so... He doesn't need the fish too hard, he kind of let him fall into this jab, but... Oh, he not to jump there? Yeah. Whoa! I'm not sure, I'm not sure what option we were going for, but that was crazy. There's a jab. And that's up. dead. That's what we needed. Got the one. Now, already doable for our min min. Five is already doable here. But one more? How well does our min min go into Sonic? I think that's the biggest question. I think one more soft from the carry here. Okay. I think, you know, I think, I think we're gold. I think on the chance that we don't win this, I think Matt Sen is really smart. Beautiful. Side that is beat. a crazy stock. That was crazy, and now it's even. We're even. There, there, that was the nair that I was talking about at sixty, bro. You hit the nair at sixty, you go into another nair, and then you go into a rising nair, and powered burn knuckle, and then you have a stock. And we don't even have to go yet. We have the go on the board now at perfect percents because we're only at one hundred and two. Best case scenario for having go being at a super low percent as well. Mega Man so, is is heavy, but not go heavy. Mega Man gets hit on on side stage by about I think by Buster with that might be a stock here. Yep. Yeah, that's, that's okay. Understandable. I mean, that's it. Um, Power Dunk was a little bit scary there, a little bit risky. Might have tried to go a little bit lower and rip a burn knuckle super deep, but it's like a 50-50 whether he dies there or not. So James, either way, he took the two. James took four stocks last time. He did. We have including from the Sonic and the Mega Man. Yeah. Yep. So. So we know we know Mitch could probably take the Mega Man. No, we know Mitch, not Mitch. Oops. We know James can take the Mega Man, but I'm. This is this is insane. Very. Is he, I mean, Aug played out of his mind. Still playing so simple. Yeah. You know, we're getting it the just played so simple, and it just he got it done. It was it was crazy. Nothing like Aug. Game one. Og was for some fancy maneuvers yep. and got the jab one into a run back up smash, yeah. which was crazy. He did some fancy maneuvers last game, but he's been playing very fundamental this game. How did Augment land that kill? Burning knuckle? Yep, nair, nair into burn knuckle. Yeah. Actually, nair, nair, rising nair into burn knuckle. Nair, nair, yeah. nair. It's like triple nares. There's, there's, a, lot sure of, a, triple there's a lot of nares. And that was a kill at like what sixty? Yeah. Yeah, it was crazy. It was crazy. Yeah, let's go. We James. We kills at sixty. We're just Yo, going crazy. James is bopping his head. He's singing. I think he's got the Taylor Swift on right now. Yep. He's a James Swiftie. about to go crazy. James he's gotta go Swiftie. crazy. Let's go, Manchester. Awakening is in the chat now. All right, I think we might have hit 30. I think we, we might have 30 people in here. This is the best school we've faced all year. Three, two, one, go! Main man, having a, having a home. 30 people, in, 30 people viewing Manchester right now. You know, maybe if we go... No, I can't say that. I can't say that. Maybe, maybe we'll hit 40 before game ends. Ooh, I think... Did, was that a jab lock? I was looking at the small screen. Oh no, but... James, looking confident. Looking good. Mega Man definitely changed up his game plan a little bit. Throwing out more projectiles than before, as we can see. Instead of trying to go into those bears and bears as much. This is about... This is where... This is what happened the last time. 
as well. And then James just started clutching up the second that this Mega Man got in the 60. Mega Man definitely. Ooh, Great going. Coming. Going for some early kills. Mega Man going for the up tilt, not getting punished though. That was a great back here for that dash attack. Wow. Oh my goodness. Whoa. He wants the kill. He wants that kill so badly. That would mean everything for this team too because if they lose, that's game. This Mega getting Man the sour getting, spot. is getting ex incredibly unlucky with these up tilts right I now. Do, yeah. And I'm all for it. <laughs> I'm all for it. That was insane. The first one should have hit. The second one should have killed. And we're still thriving with three stocks. This is incredible. See, I think... Do we think... get it here? Do we get it? This is the question. I, th I thought... That's it. Oh, there it is. Catching oh. the jump. That's not it. Not strong enough. Or maybe too stale. I had to switch the arms there. This is... This is scary. Mitch... I mean, why do I saying Mitch? James wants this. Not dead yet. But the blade's gonna have to air dodge. Got the stop. Best. Yeah. That's alright. As long as we're not gonna get cheese on this stock, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling pretty confident here. There it is. That's, that's not that's it. That's not it. it. Still there it still, is. There it is. That's big. We're only down one stock. We've been down with only one stock for a minute now. There's. I remember we started off by being down two. We did start off by being down two. We are definitely bringing this back. And now we can expect to see a Sonic. We 100% expect Sonic here. We will not see Peach. I don't That's think, not going to happen. I don't think we'll see Peach at all. Nope, definitely not. Especially not, not in this matchup. Not, not the, Maybe it's a mix up next round. Maybe, but... come on, James. Come on, James. Yo, James. Yo, Fort Wayne stocks are up right now, guys. James is locked in in the way that James locks in. He is singing, he is bopping. He's going crazy. I don't, I don't think James could be in a better mood right now for this, for this last, for this last person, for the Sonic. I don't, I don't think there's, I don't think there's anything James could do to be more prepared. Never been higher. Yeah, I need, I need to honestly, I need to get a frame where I can just see only, only Never the person higher. on the cam, just so that. Just so that James can just be full on screen right now. This is uh We're in a good spot. I mean, obviously being down one is a pretty big disadvantage. But it's also Min Min Online. Yeah, it is Min Min Online. So we'll see where that takes us. Min Min Online is not something you want to play with or play against. It's a it's hard. It's really hard. <laughs> the amount of times that I've wanted the shield in it. Hits me right before anything can happen. That door is still locked. That's, that's so weird. There's not even a lock. There's nowhere to lock that door. They're bringing in Peach? They're sending in Peach. And Colin plays a little bit of Peach, so I think... They're asking, they're asking Colin for stage bands. That's crazy. So, that Sonic must... No, we're not lying. <laughs> we're not lying. Aug just came over here and said they're sending, they're sending Peach. They have a Sonic and they're sending in Peach. They, they, yes, they have a Sonic and they're sending in the Peach. I did not expect this at all. <laughs> at all. This is crazy. They, they came in and asked me the Peach bands. They're the same player? Are you sure they're the same player? That guy does not play Sonic. His Sonic goes 2-2 on a good day. Are you, are you from? Are you one of the Stony Brook guys, or do you know well, the they're, player? Well, they're they're two of the people saying it, so I definitely believe oh, them. Crazy, oh, it is. So his Sonic goes to the. Yes, that's Cody. All right. So I guess we had uh, we had a tad see, bit of misinformation. We, we were no. told the sub was uh the peach was one of those subs so. i'm surprised they went peach i mean like i guess if it's a 2-2 sonic on a good day wait the that's... peach is cody okay so we have a lot of people in trying to know this player this is crazy this is actually a really hard matchup for peach, for peach. That's... very hard <laughs> Maybe he, maybe he's more confident. I mean, if he's a Peach main, it makes sense. Oh, we already got the winky face online though. This could be a lot of damage. But we'll, we'll see like how advanced this Peach is. But like I've played this matchup many times against James, just because you know I have a little pocket daisy that I 
Every once in a while. It's it's very good too. It's it's very hard. The, the general like floatiness aspect of peach may or may not be New York PR. That's crazy. I actually know a lot of New York players because they are randomly in my server for some reason. And New York has some crazy uh, players. I wonder if anybody here knows uh, the Kazia Zu. Uh, I don't even know how to pronounce his name. Zuhi. Zuhi. Z U H I Y. Let me know if you guys know him. Best Peach in Tri-State. That's crazy. Alright. This is a very, Ooh. like I said, extremely hard matchup. You just get caught out so often in the air and once you're there. So like what if you don't have float and you're in the air, you might as well just start air dodging. Because definitely, you're gonna get hit. Yeah. Peach definitely more confident playing main, so we'll see. Come on, James. This is crazy. Don't know Fleetwood the best or second best Min Min in Indiana. Wait, is it? Is James not the best? Um, James says he is one below. Like we, we placed him one seed below at tournaments. Uh, below. Ooh, yep, that's the stock. That's he fine did, though. He did a tether cancel and got hit by the turnip, which kind of sucks. Manchester down one stock easily, easily able to come back, especially since Peach is at such a high percent. He's got the big ball that That's hits really hard. That's a that stock. is a stock. This is even games. This is this is grabs right here. This Peach, it, it's a it's Peach. Peach could do a lot of damage here. We get the turnip. Not a lot comes out of this, but like that was a good cash. That was like kind of clutch. Not getting any disadvantage there. I. James is James and Clay are two of the players that I see lab with other characters' items quite often. So I'm wondering if James knows anything with Stitch, uh, the Stitch face, whatever it's called. I don't play Peach. Ooh, going for an edge guard. Get the back air here. We're not seeing a turn up edge guard, which is good. Good for us. James going crazy. Wow, they both committing to some pretty laggy options here. You can definitely sense the nervousness on both teams. The this, down hairs are going crazy This right is now. intense right now. Very intense. It's Look at the air dodge coming through. The up air dodge, no float. Another air dodge coming through. That's a triple air dodge and one disadvantage. Going high, has to go high. Another air dodge, has to keep air dodging. There's no choice here. There's just nowhere to run. We're gonna see another, another air dodge. That Was that a sour up smash? Another air dodge. Ooh, we've, that was close. I'm sweating bullets over here. All right, this is. We're not even at 100 yet on the min, -min and that's a stock. And that's we won. Stock. They're popping up. <laughs> I'll let them play right now. Landed recording. James does not pop off. That was an amazing game. It makes you wonder: Would the Sonic have done better? Of course, everybody else saying the Peach is his main. So who really knows? Yo, Linny coming in. Holy. Yo, that was a crazy match. Every single one of these players were playing out of their minds today. Especially August. August with the pop-off was insane. It was actually insane. But that's that's going to conclude uh, the Nace Week 4 against Stony Brook. It was an amazing game. We, got, we saw... I want to say a lot of upsets. We saw, we saw all upset quid once, maybe, maybe consider a second time, a sec twice. Of course, Stony Brook being the best in Nace, this is a crazy match for Manchester to win. So that was very important for us, and I think the team morale is definitely at an all-time high. So definitely looking forward to seeing what the rest of Nace is going to look like, especially especially Gleck but yes everybody everybody popping off in chat it was crazy I thought I thought that Peach was gonna potentially get a back air and take that game but James 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 clutched up to Taylor Swift music so that's that's insane but anyway that's gonna be the end of the match and I believe let me check and see what matches we have coming up we have we have Val Thursday at 9 p.m., which I don't think is happening anymore. We have Smash 
Rocket League and Overwatch versus Valpo Saturday. We're traveling there, and so we're kind of excited for that. And we also have League Saturday at 4 p.m. being streamed. If you guys want to tune in to the Smash Rocket League and Overwatch games at Valpo, they will more than likely be streaming that. Uh, and I hope to see you guys there. And yeah, that was we did an amazing job, and it was an extremely fun match to watch overall. But anyway, that's that's going to conclude the Manchester stream for the rest of the night. So you guys have a good one. Thanks for thanks for tuning in. That match was it, it was awesome. It was insane. It, it was definitely a um, it was definitely clutch. So you guys have a good one. Great job, Alex. Thank you, Mama Elliot. You guys all have a good night.